This video was shot at twitch.tv slash demonthour. Okay. It's one too many turns for that, but no. okay. I could not bear to lose you. Please, allow me to apologize for the manner in which I have treated you. In my weakness, I fail to accept that you are not the same divine dragon as... I understand that clearly now. And if you would allow it, I would like to begin. I'd like that too. Thank you, Divine One. Do you think Nell is all right? He is merely unconscious. But let us reclaim the bracelet while we have the opportunity. The bracelet of the Shepherd Exalt. The only one we had from the start at Lethos Castle. I never imagined that we would be forced to do battle with you, Hemplum Cro. I knew you would triumph. The darkest futures still have hope may you both cherish your new bond we will let us make haste to the fort <laughs> why would he laugh Unless that's what he wants. There's so many. Yes. Every time we defeat. We cannot sustain this for much. We can take shelter behind that altar and escape them for a moment. <sighs> Phew. Finally. A chance to catch our breath. Not for long. The enemy will break through in time. What do we do? As far as we know, it... The stone only allows them to transform, and that's not necessarily all of them, as well as it kind of shows the life, the sustaining life force of them. It doesn't allow There's you to also control them. There's one exit, and it's blocked by a sigil calling forth more... You mean, we're trapped? Indeed. Trapped in a temple full of... It's fortunate we got Lady Nell out when we did. She could have been as much as I hate to say it. There appears to be no escape. <sighs> I have a plan. You do? I mean, great. That's a plan to sacrifice our lives to take out his what? <laughs> Good enough. Let's hear it. We can only do so much fighting individually, but what if we could crush them? We can head to the four corners of the temple and knock down the pill that will destroy the temple. Hmm. If all goes well, we will also prevent them from pursuing Lady Nell and the Divine. But... And I just want to be clear. We all get flattened, right? Correct. I approve. If all the roads lead to death, let's at least take the one that brings those creatures. It would appear this is our best option. Count... But... <sighs> yeah. I'll do it. You are all certain about this? At least we're going together, right? No one has to face the end. <clears throat> Gregory, it will probably hurt a bit. Yeah, I think so. But it's fine. If I remind myself this is the last pain I'll ever feel, I mean, I, I probably can. Madeline, there was perhaps there was a way for me to destroy two pillars, so you... Why? Are you afraid I won't be up... No, not at all. Then I reject your proposal. I want to share my fellow Wind's fate. Whatever... Besides, your plan depends on us destroying the four pillars at the same time. I urge you, do not make this sacrifice just to be known as a hero. The dead do not hear praise. I don't know if he can shatter the stone. That's the problem. I know. My mentor because it might just destroy her dragon powers, I guess, which would put her in like a hibernated state like we did or how we ended up i guess and above all living a life one can be proud of you really have grown into it hearing you say that i can face whatever well friends looks like our time's i'm glad we got this final chance i love you all now Let's destroy them! 
Ah, now that their resolve is Lady there. Nell, this is as far as we go. I hope you and the Divine Dragon find a way to save Lord Nil. Listen up, Four Winds. Break the pillars! What was that? I heard... My winds. <laughs> Nil. My corrupted have performed better than I could have hoped. The temple, and unless my senses have failed me, nothing within the rubble survives. The four winds are... No! How did this happen? We were deceived. The four winds and I were attacked by the corrupted and such. They remained behind so that I could escape and make my way to you. No! You refused to cooperate with me earlier, Divine One. Perhaps... No! If you value her life, you will meet me on the island that once floated among the clouds. Nils! <sighs> An island... The island it that you call been home. Some time since those twins betrayed me. Soon, my foe will strike me down. Perhaps I will deliver a killing blow in turn. So he is capable of controlling her. It matters not. All is in motion. My child will realize my desires. Meanwhile. The Divine Dragon will die childless, with no heir and no legacy, the fool. My pawns move as I will them to, without hesitation. But I wonder, how long will that son of mine keep up this ruse of being Nell's twin? After all, her real twin is no more. That failure died. Holden Somnelia. Okay. Why didn't he try to take the seven bracelets? Do you actually? wish to remain innocent, holding fast to the teachings you follow? Or will you seize victory, your hands stained with the blood of old friends? The most unbearable pain is now a fond memory, a desperate dream. But I know the truth. In this world, there is no eternity. Now is the time to awaken. I am reminded of when we were young. You always slept deeper and later than me. I would anxiously wait for you to awaken. Outside, the world was full of foes. I could do nothing on my own. I could not transform, no matter how I wished for it. I was a powerless whelp, a failure. I was convinced I would not survive long. You had... So little hope. You are awake. I would advise you not to consider transforming and fleeing. You will lose any part of you that moves from that spot. Please stop this, Nil. There is no reason to pursue power here. You cannot rule an empty world. You and I are all that remain. Power is purpose. This world means nothing to me. 
If it must be destroyed to achieve my ends, then so be it. But you would not understand that. You know nothing of weakness, of humiliation. That is all in the past. Your friends love you. Think of our time at Lethos Castle. All of us together, as a family. Thinking of that age of lies fills me with nothing but resentment. You cannot mean that. It is amusing to hear you say we were a family. The irony is so delicious, I simply must share. I am not your twin brother. <sighs> I took the place of young Nell when he and I were children. Your precious twin, the one you so yearned to protect that you fled our father and risked all... He has been dead for quite some time. <sighs> Do you see it now? You are alone. Your beloved divine dragon, the four winds, your real twin brother? All gone. <laughs> Isn't it wonderful? At last, we will face each other as true peers. And when that struggle finally ends, you can put an end to me. What? I have always been a miserable and lonely child. I cannot even recall the face of my own twin. I knew you would never forgive my deception. But for a time, I cherished being your new. You were so gentle and giving with me. <clears throat> so kind. I began to think of you as my one true sister. Even now, the memory of our time at Lethos Castle is priceless to me. But that treasure is a stolen one. And this pain... This pain is unbearable. So please, please put an end to my misery. What is this, Nil? Tell me what is happening. No. No! Put an end to my misery? Pathetic, laughable. Ah, split personality. Father laid his hand upon my chest. He named me his true heir. I cannot stop until his ambitions are fulfilled. Surely that is what he intended me to achieve. No, he would not call me his heir otherwise. Perhaps it was a trick or simple pity. I do not know. Curse this pain, it never ends. No, stay with me. I will, I will avenge father, carry out his will, and become heir to the fell dragon legacy. So, the Somniel of this world has fallen. I guess I'm not surprised. Divine One, you... I'm only here for Nell. Please, let her go. Dispel the ward on the final bracelet and I will consider it. The ward? This is the bracelet of the three house. A ward has been placed upon it, so that none may access its power. The emblems within cannot be roused. Nor can the bracelet be moved from this location. So the Somniel fell from the sky, but it didn't knock the bracelet loose. Must be frustrating. Quite. The Divine Dragon told me about the war just prior to the final battle against Father. It can only be broken by the one who placed it. And that f Which is why I could not become Father's true heir. Not even with all seven. It was your arrival that rekindled my hope. I have long and... Because I can remove the war. You can. And you will. Or I will slay now. Do not do this to... I have to. It's done. <laughs> Because the the dragons are born as pairs, aren't they? The last of the bracelets is finally in my hands. Something about his split personality. Awaken emblems! Grant me my dis. At last, father. I. Oh, was he finally able to transform? 
Good for I've him. Done what you asked. Now Why would I do that? Now that I have what I monster. <laughs> Farewell, wretched sister. No, that's quite enough. What is this? Celestia, Gregory, Madeline. Are you injured, Lady Nell? My winds. Words cannot express my relief. I am glad to see you well. Wait, where's Mavir? Divine One, Lady Nell, Mavir is... What happened? The pillars have been destroyed. Goodbye, my... <gasps> Mavir, did you... Is that a warp staff? Where's Celestia? Did you send her? This was always my intention. Why should all of us die when only one of us need remain here? You idiot! You can't warp yourself out with that! Give it over! If it... Gregory, you are Celestia's new sec. Why didn't you tell? Madeline, I wish you the greatest happiness. I see now that protecting you was my... Stop that! Stop saying goodbye! I thought we'd go together. I would not have to say this. So Lady, so Lady Vale is, was in this world as well. Okay. No. I can't believe it. A selfless, heroic sacrifice. To think right, but, uh, I stilled only one of you awful wits. How are you alive? <laughs> no matter. You are all detestable in the eyes of Lord Sombron. And you will perish here! No, Nil. We won't let you follow in Sombron's footsteps. We'll stop you from becoming his heir, whatever it takes! Wins! Yes. You may have killed one of us, but we are still a mighty Tempest. I won't back down. Mavir would tell me to be brave as the new second-in-command. When my liege walks down the wrong path, it's my duty to stop them. I cannot bear to lose any of you. Let this be our f brother. Uh, now we finally get to fight. 15 minutes of cutscenes. Uh. Please, you have to stop him. You can have all that remains of my power. This is... Thank you. This terrain is unstable. We should hurry toward that island to the...
everybody is going to go up the left side. I think I like the alternate version better. Just because the dress is a bit more fitting for her. Eh, uh, alright. Leave it to me. I'm prepared. As much as I am enjoying being underleveled, this is just absurdly annoying. Like, I would, I would love to be able to attack the guy, but I literally only do one point of damage, and that's per one character using a single sword. I mean, you can fight with the dress. No mistakes. Reinforcements will be coming from that vortex. Let us disrupt it. They're strong. Hector Command surviving there with uh Hector. Okay. An odd question, does he hit his own units?
Or does it sound like there's Mario Kart Give in the game right now? Uncertain as to where to actually try to put my people. Okay, so he's moving. I'm sorry, Divine One. It would be rash to press on. Fucking Ivy. <laughs> Damn it. I'm not scared. Seems like he's gonna come over this way. So let's start by getting these guys out of the way. No, why would I want to be there? Because then he's just gonna attack around him. Oh well, I'll, I guess I'll let him do with that guy. And that does hit his allies, okay. That was unsettling. Had I been s Nils seems to be drawing power from those he kills in this way. It may be worth the risk to reduce the number of foes on an island, but Unless I was supposed to attack him and have him heal, I guess. 
But how the hell am I supposed to attack him when I only do one point of damage? Yeah, I'm, I'm very confused as to how to do this fight right now. Because if he is designed to heal only that, then it's going to be very annoying. I only had breakfast today because I wasn't hungry after breakfast. What's wrong with you? Eat more. Yes. Okay. Let's go. Water counts as food, and you have to always have that. Is he gonna summon more until I actually come and do damage? Oh, that's gonna be pain! Plus, I apparently don't have my emblem anymore. Okay, I don't know when I lost that. Water doesn't count. Okay. What? Yeah, you're just some more people, okay. You just magically spawn down there and are capable of floating. Oh, okay. Ready. Gonna go make myself a microwave sandwich. Okay. By all means.
Yanaka here. This is ridiculous. Uh, I'll pull back for now. Okay. Our foes are strong. Here we go. I die. Okay, but by taking out his retainers, am I able to actually fight him? Is it go time? Yes, I can. I can do damage. Okay, that is good. Das is good. Anytime. Who the heck even just attacked you? I think Shoal can get to that last one there. What a lovely scene. Just just barely actually. Okay. Really? You had a 70 He's a huge target. How'd you miss? You knock it here. I 
I don't have other healers, so... Uh, Getting hungry. No, that's a terrible place to put it. I'll do as you command. <laughs> I can carry on. This is very slowly getting me a brain. My wish has finally come true. This world will fall. You're right. And by removing the ward on the final bracelet. But I was summoned here to save you. As long as there's hope for that. I require no saving. It is enough for me to watch you die. I'm not here for... I'm here because someone wished for your salvation, even if it meant the world would... Don't you see? There are people who love you. Exciting. Oh, you can do a decent damage. All right, get in there. So, help yourself to some. I don't. I'm a knight. You mean to it wasn't you? And in memory of that sacrifice, I'm going. That is justice. Out. 
have these guys be over here. Do you miss your old world? Pity. I am shocked you are not fleeing. Does that mean... If you're gonna... It must have hurt. Do you understand how much that hurts? Do you? Aren't you... Would it truly appease you to wring a few tears? Oh, I'll give you something to be sad about. The Lord Nell I knew. I will strike you down. And I will share a second income... What am I talking about? Of course I can attack this guy. Now look. I would like you to fall over. I am defeated? This cannot be! Father! Father! I didn't know such thing. The bracelets? Where did they go? They disperse when their duty is done. Then I guess this is goodbye. Why? Why? Even with the power of the bracelets, why am I no match for you? Perhaps you see it now. The path Sombron laid out for you was never the right one. If I cannot carry out Father's wishes, then my existence serves no purpose. All my life I have sought to be valued, only to discover that I am truly worthless. I will never be like you. You are not worthless. You are my irreplaceable twin brother. We are two halves of a whole. Ridiculous. I already told you I am not nil. I know. Not nil? I don't understand. What happened to- He died in battle, a thousand years ago. Shortly after Nell gave him her dragon stone. He wanted nothing more than to make his sister proud. And who are you? A fell dragon whose twin perished when I was too young to remember it. I was a lone child, with no abilities to distinguish me. Surrounded by pairs of twins. Until I met Nil. The resemblance between us was uncanny, and we discovered we had much else in common. We were inseparable for a time, and I was all too happy to have something like a real brother. He was my other half. <sighs> that was how I felt, at least. But for him, there could be no rep When I found him on the battlefield, breathing his last, his only thoughts were of her. He gave me her dragonstone, and said that he wished Nell would never have to grieve for that reason. So you became Nell? I made it appear as if I had been the one to die that day. In a way, I was. 
There would be no one to mourn my passing. Father would not even notice. I'm having trouble believing... Believe it. I am an imposter. You should not hesitate to kill me. I brought this world to the brink of ruin. If you allow me to live, I will do it again. Let that be your reason, if nothing else. What say you, Nell? I knew you were not Nell from the... What? I have known about his death for a long... I saw through your ruse from the beginning. I simply chose not to confront you about it. You took his place for his sake, and for mine. That was an act of kindness. We may not have been born as twins. But I have always thought of you as my other half. Then... You are a fool! Say what you will. I speak the truth. You will recall how we visited the burial site at Letho's castle to say our farewells. You may not have seen that I left a pressed flower there. It was Nell's. I was not saying goodbye only to the Divine Dragon that day. You were saying it to Nelt. I carried that flower for a long time. I suppose some part of me was unable to move on. Despite that, you became very dear to me. Your companionship saved me from loneliness and despair. I was happy to be a sister to you. I will always cherish our time together. Even if you do not feel the same. Without you, I would never have been able to continue fighting all this time. I trusted you above all others. Belie the only proof that we are not true twins is that I failed to sense your actual intentions. Perhaps. I confess, I have longed to hear you say such things. Are you ready? Yes. Thank you. For goodbye now. Goodbye. Stop. What are you... No! There is another way. Once I am gone. For my part, I would rather... No! If only I had realized sooner. Seeing Nell... Why does everybody want to commit suicide? Like, Maybe bro. Too much to hope for. But even so, I will rest well knowing your pain is at an end. Why would you do this? I deserve this fate, not you. You should have killed me. I could not bear to lose a second brother. Before I go, Like, every, every single person so far has tried to off themselves in Lady some no. way. She's... She's gone. No last words of reproach. No re All she wanted. <gasps> Rafal, sister. My name is Rafal. Rafal. How did I forget my... Nil asked me to look after his sister. But it was not merely his wish. All I wanted. All I... When did I forget those... You said this would be the end of my pain, Nell. How could it ever... I sense something. The dragon... That is Sombron's magic. Could it be that he cast a spell on that dragonstone? To sow the seeds of hatred in the heart of Lord Nil. Dragonstones are destroyed by the death of their owner. Lady Nell died to break the spell. Sombron made it so that you two would fight each other instead of conspiring against him. Nonsense. You mean to say that it was just some spell? That all should be forgiven? Ridiculous! Regardless of Sombron's influence, I am responsible for my own actions. I chose to do what I did. It was what I wanted. I will not allow anyone else to shoulder my blame. <sighs> I sought power and I attained it. Even now, I have no regrets about that. I only wish that I could have kept the promise I made to Nell. <sighs> Divine One. What is it? 
I have heard that dragons of great power can impart their life for... Do you suppose that is true? Yes. My mother did that for me. But it took a thousand years before I woke up. Then I will do the same. I will revive now. Even if it takes me just as long, I will dwell in this empty world alone. In the hope that she will one day rise. Perhaps that will be a fitting punishment for what I have done. And perhaps... If and when you wake, we may truly become two halves of a whole. You will. No. You all... Is that so? Rafal. After Nell wakes up? Why don't you come live with me in my Elios? What? I have a feeling you'd be able to travel there from here in the Somniel. It's hard to explain. But I can sense my world right now. It feels... closer. Yes. It would seem that a path to other worlds lies open. Perhaps it is due to the bracelets. I did wish to grant my father's desire, if the conquest of other worlds was part of his plan. But I believe it is as you said. It should be possible to move between worlds from here. Then I'll grant you both my protection so you can travel there. When you're ready. The Somniel can't be entered without my blessing as a divine. So come find me. That invitation is open, however long it takes for you to accept it. You would make an ally of the one who so recently... If you are asking me here and now, then my answer is certainly no. That said, I will say this. If, by some miracle, Nell awakens and finds it in her heart to forgive me, then, and only then, will I journey to you. I understand. Now, there is nothing more to say. As you wish. I hope to see you again, though. Lord Rafal? Yes? Despite all that's happened, I am... I hope that we'll meet as allies again. Your kindness is wasted on me. That doesn't seem like it's it. Here we are, back at Lethos Castle. It feels as if we've been gone for eight. So much has happened since I first met Nell and Nil here. The kings and queens, the emblems. Yes, and Mavir too. <sighs> what should we do now? Beats me. Every nation's lost its rulers, and probably their whole populations by now. I guess we could try to rebuild, or each grab an empty throne and call ourselves rulers. Rulers with no subjects. I fear we have little to do but bide our time until the end. What if you came with me? Divine one? This world is beyond saving. You said it yourselves. There's... I'm just a visitor. I have to go back before long. But if I leave you behind, I can't even be sure how long you'll survive. It would mean throwing yourselves into battle again. But still, I hope you'll consider it. Sounds pretty good to me. Better than twiddling our thumbs to the grave, at least. I say we go. A new world might mean scary new enemies and dangers, but... It's an appealing proposal, but... I wonder what Mavier would say. What do you mean? We are his family, and if we go, he'll be left here all alone. It doesn't seem fair. Why should we be the lucky ones? Why do we deserve this? Deserve what? Madeline, what's the last thing that the big guy, that Mavir, said to you? He said he wished me the greatest. There you have it. He'd probably tell you to look forward, not back. You don't get to speak for him. You didn't know him like... I knew him pretty darn well. We spent a ton of time together. Anyway, you gotta admit, he wouldn't want you sulking. <sighs> Mavir would tell me to go. This is still a little hard to, to like, follow, him. but alright. Go ahead and cry, Madeline. There hasn't been time to mourn him since... I'm sorry. You were born into this world and... But if it makes any difference, 
I spoke to Rafal. He's planning to come as well, one day. You could wait for him with me. Divine One, it feels wrong to be the only ones going, to leave our Lord and Lady behind. I understand. But instead of languishing here, we could go to a... And after everything that's happened, I find it difficult to turn down your request. We have been through so much. Yes, we have. I'm inclined to go. Do the two of you... Yep. I agree. Then from now on, the remaining winds will swear our loyalty... We will go with you, Divine One. I'm glad. Not gonna mention that the, there's a Mavier on that side? The feeling is mutual. All right. Remember, you two. We if have I to work remember correctly, he was the only one that survived world. on that side. What? We're not calling ourselves the three? You knew the answer before you even asked. We four are a family and will always be together. Nothing can change. All right, everyone. Still now, not going to mention. The fall. <sighs> okay. Thank you, my fellow Divine Dragon. I pray your future is filled with hope and love. And please, take good care of them for me. So this one just be, seems to be flip-flopped of whatever character you are. Which is kind of interesting. I do like Nell's uh, character design a lot. It's a shadow wolf. Okay. I'm trying to open subtitles, but subtitles no open. When did we encounter Xander? Okay, I, I must have completely glazed over that then. Notice this is them in uh, Somali. So they did meet the new Mavier. So that is canon. And then the seven, seven bracelets because they put the three in one for whatever reason. Celeste, Gregory, and Madeline joined the group. Okay. Ah, <sighs> the weather's so... That bright blue sky feels like... I could not agree more. <sighs> Nell! Rafal! I did... It has been some time, Divine One. For me, it has been a thousand years. But Nell has returned, and we have come as promised. 
My sister and I are at your disposal. Welcome to you both. It really is a lovely morning. So then are they... Emblems or... Actual people. They're actual people. Okay. 